Oh well, oh well. Uh huh. Oh well, well. This video is the start of an epic mining server. We are gonna go all in on this server, and it's gonna be budgeted like just like real life. Like I'm gonna start off so small, literally, that I won't even have like cat equipment. I'd be using like other stuff, anything I can get my hands off, just farming equipment, just to start off this mining server. As you can see, I have had added any money. Today's video is just okay. First of all, throughout the process, let me know what you guys enjoy or didn't enjoy about this video. That'd be awesome if you guys could tell me. But then, we are probably just going to get holding everything here, get all of our equipment set up. I'm going to go down through the budget with you guys, what I what I think I can spend, what I'm going to sell, and I think I'm going to keep this JCB. I'm, okay, dude, I, before I even get a rundown of the equipment, i got to show you guys around this place. So, this is the same mining server, right? But a lot of things actually work this time. The limestone crusher machine has worked last time. It was a little iffy. Now I think they got it down a little more. This stuff works. You can go and scoop up gravel. You can go and scoop up sand. As you can see, there's some sand there that I was messing with and just poured back in. Um, you, look, it has a number right there. How much is in there? You can go uh, scoop up stone powder and you can sell it. You can go load it up on the train over there, sell it. Or you can just truck it all the way down to the construction site, like way down at the bottom of that mountain kind of in town and sell it there. So we're going to try and make this like really profitable. And then keep buying more and more bigger equipment. This is this is my dream stuff right here, boys. This is my dream stuff to get some of this. I don't think we're going to buy this from the start. Um, I think we're going to run a John Deere tractor and a tipper from the start. Then we're going to lead up to buying this. Uh, we need some type of, oh, we need some type of water tank. I don't want to buy that right at the start. I think I'm going to buy the cat low loader. It's not too bad a price. It could haul a lot of equipment. I think I might buy that. Heck no. We cannot buy that, man. Ooh, I could buy it. I could buy this catcher. I don't know. I don't know. I think we're going to run a tipper and a tractor for now. But it's going to be still small scale. I'm not sure if multiplayer works on this yet. Yeah. It could It could be. You see tailings. You can see tailings and stuff. It's nice. I think they... I don't know if they raised this or what. But I thought... Some, okay, no. They got a cat. The, the cat The cat dump truck or the cat uh, rock truck is a lot lower than the Volvo. So it can fit under there. That's nice. And then gold, you can go and look at your gold. Uh, obviously, right now we don't have any. You can go look at it, and it shows right here. That's so cool how they just put that on there so you can see. And then you like take it, and you go take it down to the bank is what I read now this time. That's nice. They got soil, everything like this. Everything's everything's a lot better, and I think they fixed a lot of things on this. Whoa, I didn't even notice they changed this. Look. And now I heard there was a lot of changes with the train and how you could load stuff. That's cool. That's cool. Okay, we got to test out. You can also make wine on this map. There's tons of stuff we can be doing, guys. So, you guys keep me updated. I, dude, I have, like, I have a guide uh, to the screen to the right of me, so I can, and I've read through it, like, many times. I've studied that guide. So, I, dude, I should be all prepared for the server. But now, it's time to just sell equipment. So, we start off with a farming server, right? We have all of this stuff. Equipment. Screw farming for now. No, no, no. I like farming, but screw farming on this server. Just on this server, just on this server. So what we're going to do is we are going to sell sell everything, basically. Sell all the tractors. Got to sell all the tractors. And trust me, I got a new tractor coming for you guys. You guys may have saw it in the thumbnail. I'm not sure. There we go. Oh, the T7 is going to go for a lot of money. I'm, it's on the tip right now, actually. We're going to keep the JCB, I think. Ah, I should sell it and get a cat. But for now, we'll keep the JCB. Combine only goes for $25,000. Jeez. Oh, my gosh. Okay, there we go. And so that we'll keep the tipper. Tipper's going to work out good. Uh, we don't need the cultivator. Don't need a planter. Ooh, it would be cool to keep the truck. Well, uh, actually, I'm going to buy an older truck that's actually cheaper than this truck. So that will be nice. Nice. Do we need? I, I don't know where these small storage shelters are. Later, we can sell them probably. Ah. I kind of want to keep them in case they're at my place. $260,000. Dope. Okay. We'll see what we can get done with that. If not, I can borrow more money too, which is nice. Okay. I think all these vehicle shelters are just at this place, which we're not going to be using. So I'm going to start selling them. Hopefully. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Can I click on this one? Can I click on this one? Uh, Small storage. Okay. Hopefully that wasn't at our place. Okay. Should we sell this one? Okay. Hopefully we're, oh God, don't tell me we sold stuff at our, at our uh, mining place over there. Okay, whatever. I forgot what shelters were even there. Um, so there we go. 
we got that now it's time it's time to buy everything so you guys saw that tipper i had back there that's going to be our main piece of equipment to start out with and i'm going to put a john deere old john deere iron on it i'm going to put a it's a new mod that you guys haven't seen a 60 series now these things are sweet i kind of want to just get the biggest one and throw duels on it that'd be sweet and then oh, we don't need saddle tanks i kind of did pay 12 more grand just to get like how much more horsepower i don't know if that's technically worth it but we got it we got it okay so there's our first purchase right there now that now this isn't like i said i'm piecing together this operation because we don't have like two hundred thirty thousand dollars is not a lot of money to start out with so we got that here let's actually tab over it because i haven't seen this oh you guys ready oh shoot i thought it was going to be after that second train Oh, the 4960. You see, like, a lot of these I see at, like, construction sites, actually, like, around town and stuff that they use to, like, disc and stuff. But it's going to be interesting running this on a tipper. It's going to be interesting. But that's what we're, that's what we're going to use. I'm going to piece it. Like I said, I'm piecing everything together right now until we get more and more money. And we know when we find out, like, what's profitable. It would be cool to buy one of these right at the start, but I don't I don't think we're going to, guys. I don't think we're going to. Now, cat load loader. Should I get a cat load loader or what are the prices on these low loaders oh dude 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 i'm not gonna should i pay 50 grand to get one of those i don't know i don't know man okay so truck this is what i was thinking for truck this is should be released or is going to be released really soon here um then we got okay the 87 chevy flatbed this is what i was going to buy should i add anything to it oh oh dude look at that you can put 687 horsepower 454 <laughs> what the heck for only 825 bucks gas tank see oh dude let's throw both out there we got to make this thing dope the dope mobile boy oh my gosh let's see this thing out come on okay i thought i threw some stuff on it oh there we go it wasn't i threw a gas tank and stuff this is pretty cool actually it's pretty cool this is some old school stuff like i said i don't have that much money so we're gonna we're gonna try to be saving a lot of money now we need oh boy okay so i did the okay we got the okay i think the rear bun 40 foot is definitely the way to go i don't want to pay 24 more grand to get this where it can't even haul as much it's more of a what i want to call a big toy trailer where you can haul like tons of toys on it i feel like it's got some space this seems like the best choice right now so the chevy is gonna be all in this bad boy and oh okay okay oh it looks like it's stuck at the ground over there too wheel loaders now i did find the cat wheel loader it's zero dollars though like how do i do that because i'm not gonna pay zero dollars and just get free equipment and stuff like that unfortunately i really want to get a cat but for now maybe next episode we'll decide put your guys's opinion in on what i should do with that maybe i should take out some money like take out fifty thousand dollars or something like that once i buy it i don't know because it's only zero dollars okay we have two hundred ten thousand dollars have we we haven't bought a truck now i want to buy my favorite truck that i always buy unless you guys unless you guys want something different let me know but man i love this truck we're always gonna be using this truck this is a bad beast man okay so we got that now we have eighty five thousand dollars left <sighs> this is gonna be tough this is gonna be tough what do i need what do i need what do i need man um i need a water tra a mineral trailer One hundred fifty thousand for and it can't even hold i don't even think it can maybe you can hold it better be able to hold mineral water let's just say i think it can probably I guess, I guess it would be able to. Oh, dozer, cat trailer. Dude, I don't know what I want to haul. I, oh, I don't know what I want to get. Okay, so this could transport a lot once we need to sell it. But I feel like, I feel like a dump should, one of these dump trailers should be super important. We have $85,000. Or we could get an excavator. We could get the excavator, man. We could get the excavator. Does it have a bucket that comes with it? Oh boy, for two hundred thousand dollars dude i feel like we gotta get the excavator i feel like it would be a lot smarter to get this oh uh, man what do i get what do i get should i get a tanker should i get a tanker i could oh i could lease two i could lease two you know what let's add some money this is gonna be the decision right now let's add some money and uh what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in debt a ton we're gonna borrow almost all of our money we'll see i could always repay it so that's fine too I think it goes up to three hundred thousand dollars. Okay. Oh my gosh, it goes up to more. Okay, we have three hundred five thousand dollars. I think it's smart to get this. I do. I do think it's smart to get this. So that's what we'll do. We'll get a caterpillar dump. Now, hmm. I do want to get that. 
Should we get both? Can we get both? Okay, okay, for sure, for sure, for sure. We gotta get this. Caterpillar dump. And then we could get a cat excavator. We are gonna have tons of loans to repay, repay though, man. Oh, oh. I don't know how much I'm gonna use the cat excavator, so I'm gonna hold off on that for now. We have $125,000. We have to do some... Oh, dude, are we gonna be able to hold that thing? Okay, we do need to get a trailer. We do need to get... A trailer should we just get the big cat trailer because we're gonna need it to hold it's fifty thousand dollars though i feel like i feel like i'm not good at making purchases it's fifty thousand dollars but it'll haul it should we do it it's gonna haul all of our equipment our excavators everything i feel like i should be leasing it or something though okay we bought it we bought it now i think i'm gonna repay almost okay hopefully it can haul don't tell me it can't okay it should be able to haul that truck right there we should be good right there um, I'm going to pay back almost, oh wait, oh gosh, we borrowed, we kept borrowing, I'm going to pay back almost all of it, so we have like $25,000, that's a good amount, oh gosh, why did I say, oh, I almost quit the game, okay, there we go, we are good, we are good for now with equipment, now let's get started, we got to get all hold back, tell me what you guys think I should get, now I do have the JCB wheel loader, I don't know if it's going to be big enough, it's going to take a lot of loads, I feel like, to fill this truck up, oh my gosh, I don't know, I don't know what's going to be going on, I do need a mineral tank yet, because we do need mineral water for gold stone crusher i think we're gonna start on the stone crusher really and get that going until we gain some money i can't wait to get some other people in here hopefully it works multiplayer man i'm kind of betting on that i'm kind of betting on that oh boy dude this is gonna be tough to get let's see if we can't get this come on okay what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to like put oh my gosh we're driving on top of it there we go keep pushing it back i just want to push it back there we go. Go, go, go. This is sorry. This is so unrealistic. Come on. Okay, okay. Now we're just going to drive up. Oh, there we go. Pull up. And you're attached, baby. Okay, sweet, dude. The FDR truck is going to be doing hauling the rock truck, man. How much can the rock truck hold? I didn't even check. Let's check that. Let's 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 check how much the rock truck can hold. Um, 50,000 liters. Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. What, what, I have the bandit trailer, and what can that hold? Tippers. I think that can only hold like 32,000. I don't even, or 40,000. I don't even know why I need, if I have a rock truck, I don't really need the John Deere, but I want to use the John Deere. Dude, I don't know. Okay, we may be selling the John Deere really soon here. Okay, come on. Get on there. Should we sell the John Deere? Should we sell the John Deere? Ah, oh, I want to keep it though. I feel like you guys are going <sighs> to, I don't know. So we could sell the John Deere and get an excavator. We could do that. Oh boy, dude, sell the John Deere, bandit, get an excavator. But I don't think we're going to need the excavator too much. We're going to keep the John Deere. It's always nice to have around. Uh, Tipper's always going to be able to run pretty fast, I think. We'll keep it for now. How do I lower this this ramp, though? L raise, lower, ramp, 8. What? Keypad, 8. Oh, there we go. Oh, now it started going. There's, like, supports you can get to or something. There we go. Okay, we're good. We should be able to load up the rock truck, man. Oh, dude, this thing is a beast. Hopefully, it, hopefully it works good and stuff. I was gonna say that is really slow when it was backing up. It was like going so slow. Come on, load her up, dude. Oh, this is cool. This thing pivots like crazy. There we go. We got the rock truck on here. Sweet. Okay, this fits actually perfectly. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. There we go. Okay. Now, we should probably fold up the ramp. Just get that ramp fold up. Hit keypad 8. Dude, are the front tires of the... Are the... Oh, dude. It looked like the front tires were just in the air. There we go. We should be good there. The FDR truck. Dude, this is going to be so... It looks like it's in the air, doesn't it? The front tires are in the air. It somewhat looks like it. There we go. How many tires does this have? I know some dude has been counting my tires when I ever, whenever I ask how many tires it has. Like Some dude was like, oh, you had 25 or 24 tires on there. Dude, that is insane how many tires are on there. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to the Chevy and we're probably going to hold the old tractor. We'll probably use a tractor for something. I don't know what it is. I'd like to have an old John Deere tractor just around, I guess. Do I need it right away? Probably not. Probably be smarter to get the... I, I feel like we gotta get the cat wheel loader. Should we sell the JCB get the cat wheel loader or something like that? I don't know. Dude, I don't know. I don't know. For now, I'm gonna keep it like this. And, and this is kind of just like a, a comment-based video where I'm gonna be like just asking... Oh, do we get the ramps all down all the way? I'm gonna be asking you guys a lot for your opinion on this equipment I should be getting. There we go. 
Ramps are down all the way. We'll load up the John Deere. Now, this is going to go on the tipper. Mainly going to run the tipper, I think. Until we can afford another uh, cat rock truck. And boom. We're up there. We're good. We're good to go. The duels are kind of hanging off. That's cool. That's cool, though. Okay, can the old Chevy haul it, though, is the real question. I like how wide those duels are. It looks good. It looks good like that. Okay, so we'll haul with the Chevy first. Then we'll come back. Get it with the FDR logging truck. Is that... Oh, okay, I was going to say, is that cat, that cat rack truck falling off the edge? For a second, I thought it looked like it. Dude, this hole's good. Sounds like a diesel, though. It sa oh, boy. Oh, boy. We almost hit a car there. There we go. Is there... Okay, our load is locked. That's good. There we go, man. Dude, this hole is great. I like it. It just flies. This thing flies. We can do 100 mile an hour with this thing. Interior. Oh, interior is sweet on this truck, too. Okay. Stop sign. Let's actually stop since we're technically a business and we don't want to get in like... Tr oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, we got we to gotta swing really wide here. Come on. Okay, we're going to have to go over the curb here. Let's see if we can't. There we go. Are the duels going to get... Okay, we're good. Thought the duel was going to get caught there. Um, There we go. We're heading up here. We're heading back. Dude, what should I call this place? The comp. I don't know if I should call it the compound. The mining compound. Something like that. Oh, boy. Hopefully, there wasn't any car coming over. I, I could barely see over the front of my front of my uh front shield front windshield um there we go let's slow her down dude we are flying holy crap this truck can pull i might keep this truck for a while i was thinking about getting a new truck uh once business got rolling and stuff but hey maybe we'll keep this truck i don't know man this is sweet okay we're gonna keep going up there boom 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 and actually, this summer, oh boy, we're lagging. This summer, I had worked at a place that that mined soil, different types of rocks, and a lot of sand, and just sold it to uh, a lot of road construction guys and stuff. And it was pretty cool working there. I got some pictures on my Instagram of some of the equipment we were running and stuff like that. I basically did uh, a lot of the mowing and stuff and cleaning up of the site, stuff like that. Not, not the big jobs. It would be sweet to do the big jobs, but uh, I didn't. I was too young. And, dude, our truck is dirty already. Okay. We're back here. Now, this is going to be hooked up to the tipper. We're going to use this to just transport material around with a tipper instead of buying a rock truck. There we go. It only costs like $80,000 more to buy a rock truck. But for now, we'll do this. Like I said, I wanted to start off real small. I did. And got the ramp down all the way. Sweet. So, the 4960. Uh, I'm, I'm going to be used to saying the 4955. But the 4960 is going to get hooked up to the tipper boom I feel like I dude I feel like I gotta get these these trackers on my farming series there we go I think that's gonna be a good fit it's definitely gonna have enough power it's definitely good that it got front wheel assist with it too and uh, we'll just put the Chevy <laughs> the Chevy just got dirty just going through one little mud puddle man okay we're gonna probably back Let's see if we can't back this in here oh boy this is gonna get tight can we do it? Can we do it, squad? Or, dude, I don't even know what that is over there. I don't even know what that thing is. I gotta check this out, man. We like, there's so many different things. And you know what? When you go to coal and stone and dirt and stuff, it actually has a sign that says it. That's awesome. It actually has a sign that says what it is. And I gotta look in the manual to see what this thing is. Again, I thought usually there's a sign. Well, the heck, I was just talking about how there's signs for everything. Maybe, oh, nope, not up there. Um, So what we'll do now is tab around. Oh, the FDR, man, the FDR logging truck. Now it's the FDR mining truck. It'd be sweet. Actually, no, it wouldn't be sweet. But I was going to say if we could put a squad logo on here, but no. Because it's FDR and they already have their logo on there. That would be so rude to just... Put, throw my logo on the truck and stuff that'd be so mean oh boy you know what's mean driving over somebody's trash can and smashing it with like tons and tons of weight and a huge truck and trailer oh thank god that truck was turning oh boy there we go dude this and i love how cool it sounds sounds sweet is the load locked is the load lock okay you can lock the load with x oh boy there we go okay oh it's delayed uh it should be locked it should be locked okay sweet there we go, man. Is it going to be able to make it up some of these hills? Look how much gas is in my holds. Or diesel, I should say. Not gas. I'm always used to saying gas. If I had a diesel pickup truck, I'd probably say diesel all the time. But, uh, 
There we go. We're flying up here. I love it. And okay, so this cat. Ooh, this is gonna, this is gonna be sweet. This is gonna be. So I don't know because I'm gonna need two people, one to like load trucks, one to run the rock truck, and one to run the 4955 still yet. So I might get Girl Man and Spencer TV on here. I'm not sure. It'd be cool to get them on here, um, if multiplayer works the way I want it to though. Too, we gotta get multiplayer working good. And so I don't I don't know if it does work. If it doesn't work, it's it's kind of cool. It's it's kind of fine. Doing it by myself. Oh boy, this is gonna get tight. This is gonna get real tight real fast. Oh, there we go. We made it. Now we're just flying up this windy hill. Oh, another car. Oh boy. Oh boy. Come on, squad. Oh, dude, this is such a wide load. I don't know how I'm making it there. There we go. I should have took the Chevy up this path because it's not as bad. And then I'll just make my turn right here. Swinwad, my friend. There we go. We made it. And now we're going to start unloading. Oh, wait. It's eight. There we go. Unlock load. Load should be unlocked. We'll get in the rock truck. Dude, I feel like we get, oh, I feel like since we went this far, now we gotta test out this rock truck. We gotta test out everything like this. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll go load some stone actually with this rock truck. I, I gotta drive this thing down. I hate how it's uh it's pivoted. Ah, what do you call it? What how it pivots and stuff like this. I hate it makes me like kind of dizzy and stuff. It's just going all over the place and stuff to control it. Too bad I just have I mean, it probably makes it easier, but too bad it doesn't didn't just have the front wheels just turn, you know. Um, but it's fine. And, oh boy, we got some mud. Is it going to get dirty? Hey, it doesn't get dirty. Okay, okay. I don't know if that's good. I, I kind of like it to get dirty, I guess, but it's fine. There we go. It's kind of a slow truck, actually. It doesn't have too much power. So there we go. That is limestone over there. Now, there's mud this time. There's mud this time through this water and stuff. See? Isn't this cool how there's mud and stuff? I like it. Come on. Oh, dude, we're almost getting stuck in the mud. <gasps> Holy crap. I don't even know if the truck was going to make it through there. And we do have this, this uh, not excavator, but look at, check this thing out. It's not ours. It's not ours. It's just like in the game. It's kind of cool, actually, how they made this animation. I don't even know what it is. If it's like a little jackhammer that's tearing a piece, apart the pieces, I think that's what it is, probably. Now we'll tap over for the JCB. JCB is muddy. As you can see, I have tested this map to see what it all could do what what would all happen and it's going to take okay so this bucket jcb bucket holds about six thousand liters i think and that holds fifty thousand so it's going to take like 15 loads just to fill up that rock truck so we are definitely going to have to get a bigger wheel loader soon here or maybe i'll just get a bigger bucket see if we can get just a bigger bucket that holds at least like you know ten thousand would be perfect ten thousand liters uh we'll try to go around this mud just because it slows us down so much our jcb is already dirty so i don't care what i go into really you know? And we'll kind of go off the side of this cliff. Oh, there we go. Now we got to go through some mud with the JCB. Come on, JCB. Get through there. Sweet. We're there. Okay. Now it's time to start loading. Now, I don't know if we're going to get the truck fully loaded just because it takes forever, man. There we go. Hold 6,000. God, I got to figure out the best way to do this. The best way to turn. You know what? It'd be a lot easier if I back the rock truck up to... Uh, Hold on. There we go. We'll pull it, pour it in. And actually, we have the stone animations besides when you're pouring. That's the only thing. There we go. It pours a lot faster that way. And it would be a lot easier if I backed the rock truck up like right below there. Just make a quick little pivot. Dude, this thing is slow when you're turning. It like doesn't want to... It doesn't have enough power to like turn. It's weird. There we go. Unless you get going straight and then start turning. There we go. That should be good. And now it'll be a lot easier. Let's see if we can't get in the JCB. And keep loading this truck real quick. And you know what's a cheating way is to stick. I think you can like. I guess I could get a dozer and like make a huge pile of this too. That that'd be easy too. If we did a multiplayer and they couldn't dig or something, could just make a big pile. There we go. Loaded. I think I'll do like five scoops or so. I know we won't get the truck all the way full, but it'll be cool to see what just happens. You know. There we go. It'd actually be cool to have a steering wheel, guys. I don't have a steering wheel. I've always played with keyboard and mouse and some guy dm'd me on instagram the other day and was like do you need a steering wheel to play and i'm like heck no man i've been playing with keyboard and mouse the whole time there we go i'm kind of hitting the rock truck i think a little bit once i'm tipping that bucket that far and we'll keep going down boom keep taking another load i like this dude let me know if you guys are going to be pumped for this mining server we're going to go we're going to go ham and like i said right now we only have twenty five thousand dollars there's so many things you can do like every day will be something new i'm assuming 
dumper. And what load is that? Is that third or fourth or fifth? We're going pretty we're going pretty smooth, I'd say, aren't we? There we go. Back her in. Raise her up. Go forward. Oh, maybe we could get this thing out all the way full. Honestly. How full are we? Probably at 40%. 60%. Let's keep going, boys. Let's get her to 100. Let's get her to 100. We got to do it now, man. I, maybe this fill this. It seems like it fills pretty quick. It's pretty, it's pretty simple. It's not too bad. 60% ain't bad. Boom. Just go quick. Tip. We're kind of tipping on the rock truck a little bit, as you guys can see there. And we'll just keep going back down. Grab her again. Boom. Load again. Oh, dude, this could be quick. We're just going back, back and forth, back and forth. Boom. Tip. I like it. Obviously, this would get bored and boring if you have to do this like over and over again. Just there's a rock trick there every time. But there's probably a more efficient way to do it. And honestly, we could probably get a conveyor belt. Conveyor belts, I think, work pretty good too. Doing that. There we go. Dude, it's gotta be about 100 percent I'm calling it. It's 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 about there. There we go. I like how it feels so quick too. That's nice how it feels so quick. And boom. It's it's a hundred percent. Dope. Sweet. We got it to hundred percent. Gonna put that down and get in the rock truck, man. And then I'll show you actually this time the stone crusher. Oh dude, look at this. This was sketchy. I was like looking at his face. That was weird. Um the rock the stone crusher actually works on this map this time. It's nice. Version four or version point four or something like that. Oh, dude. Oh, my gosh. We barely get through there with this truck. I wonder if the John Deere is going to make it through there, though. There we go. We're just going to head up here. Come on. Make it up the hill, dude. It has a hard time making it up some of these hills and stuff. This thing is slow. It needs more power, man. We should probably try to avoid the mud a little bit just because it slows us down so much. Oh, boy. We're going over. To oh, we are going to flip almost. There we go. Maybe I should get those Volvo trucks. I think I, I, think I like Cat Bear and Volvo, though. Definitely. And we'll hit the mud again. All these mud spots are kind of annoying, to be honest with you. <laughs> it's, it, I mean, it's fine. It's fine, I guess. It's pretty realistic. Um, hit the mud again. And if we can even make it up the side of this. Go, go, go. This thing is slow, dude. Okay, so we, I feel like I should have a, a mining live stream. I feel like that would be pretty sweet. And what we'll do is we'll pull through here. This is where the stone crusher is. Unfortunately, the driveway is kind of tight and stuff through here. Check this out, though. We, you got stone in there already, too. I think if you run the clock faster, it'll work a little. There we go. Unload. We're unloading, baby. We are unloading. Holy crap, man. Look at it go. And then if you run the clock, it should. This, I'm assuming the stone will process a lot faster. Wow. So 51, 750. Okay. Now let's pull over here. And I want to pull over. Okay. There we go. I want to pull over. I want to run the clock real fast. And then I want to pull over here and see you can check how much is in here. And actually you can take a, you can take, a, we'll probably need two wheel loaders to load up over here and stuff. But you can just take a wheel loader and see sand 10,000, um, gravel 3,500. So now let's speed it up to 120. Boom, it's going. It's going a lot faster. Nice, nice, nice. What's what's sand at? Sand's at 13,000. Holy crap, we got a lot of stone powder. Wow, stone powder goes real fast. Okay, so we'll keep it like times five. Times five's good. And then we got to start loading this stuff up probably on the train, I'm guessing. Could load a lot up on the train and just start selling it. So that's where we're going to make our money. And actually, I want to see how much we can get. You can look at some of the prices. Let's check out some of the prices. It's actually got prices for this stuff. I'm not sure what the animations are, though. I couldn't tell you. Gold. Look at gold, man. I think we could. We should go full on on gold. We could make a lot of money. Look at that. Is, that's just for one liter, 1,000 liter. There's asphalt. There's cement. However, you can make cement. We have all the materials to make cement. I'm not sure what some of this stuff is, but uh, like fuel, stuff like that. So, we're, dude, we're going to make money. It's going to be profitable. It should be. It should be pretty fun. Hope you guys did enjoy this mine episode. Mine hauling. Mine episode number one. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it. And if you did appreciate this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Thanks for watching, guys.